Your cursed ship is hiding, Tech Marine. Hold your tongue, Avidus. transmission from the traitor. We should review it before launching another mission. The Judgment of Carrion has a conglomeration of ancient vessels which have become adrift in space and time. It travels at random, spending decades or even centuries in the warp. If I may, its travels are not entirely random. Only the Emperor can know what horrific planes the Judgment of Carrion has visited. But its recorded appearances have all been in this sector or in one of its neighbors. Yes, and because of that, the Astronomic Array had a detailed record of past appearances. A distinctive pattern of warp anomalies preceded each appearance. And that pattern is occurring again. Precisely. How does any of this blather help identify the traitor? The machine spirit aboard the Retribution is not sufficient to remove the masking on the message you recovered. But there are references to a far more ancient and wiser logic engine aboard the Judgment of Carrion. With it, I can identify the heretic. Like Martellus, I have been trying to identify the traitor using our shipboard cogitators. Have you made any progress? Of a sort. This message was in our own transmission tomes. Angelos has us charging around the sector on the Retribution. They know about me. Or at least that I exist. Only the Vox Cloak Invocator has masked my identity thus far. The traitor is here, aboard the Retribution. He is one of us. We need to reactivate the ancient logic engine aboard the Judgment of Carrion. To recover the proper activation rights, you must locate data slates hidden in the surrounding decks. Because you will be operating deep within the Space Hulk, the Retribution can only offer very limited support. Jump packs will be useless in the confined space, although teleport systems will function. to access the vault. They should be in data racks of some sort. We have no time to waste. The foul resonance of the warp is already palpable. Chapter's holy gene seed. If an apothecary collected it, why leave it here? A fair question, but we cannot overlook the opportunity to recover Blood Raven's gene stock. Be vigilant for other vials or signs of an apothecary. Commander, the rules indicate Bonaparte still serves in the Chapter Honor Guard. How can that be?
destruction. Tyranids aboard these derelicts can evolve to suit the environment. Yes, I sense powerful psychic enemies. Even against the war machines. Tyranids feral? Only without a leader creature nearby. Remember, when connected to their synapse web, all Tyranids become deadlier. Kill them all! Let there be blood! The warp is making itself felt, Commander. We must hurry.
Activation rights. Another will do. It must be mine. Then we can fight back. It will be mine. Another fallen brother. Veteran Lucanus, also of the 5th Company. And another reductor vial. Martellus, what do the rolls say about Brother Lucanus? Killed in the Karava campaign. I was at Karava. I recall no Lucanus. Commander, both Bonaparte and Lucanus served in an expedition aboard the Judgment of Carrion. I shall try to uncover more about this expedition. The chapter shall not forget your deeds this day. explains the reductor vials, but not why they were left behind. Another door blocks our way. There's a data slate on the door. Xeno's detected. Eliminate them. The logic engine must not be damaged.
to the logic engine. It'd best be worth sending us into that foul place, Tech Marine. Recovering Gene Seed alone is worth the risk, Avatus. I will begin analysis of the logic engine right away, Commander. We have also received several distress signals from across the sector. Go ahead, have some fun. <laughs> 